Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Now we are in Lord & Taylor trying on some a bunch of stuff from Melissa McCarthy. So let's go ahead and hop into it. I love this tunic dress here. I love the detailing along the breast neckline area here. It's super warm, but it's short. Girl, it is short on me. Now it's on a regular person, it would obviously be a regular dress, um, but on me, it's just really, really short. Um, it's long in the back, but really short in the front, but I think I could work it out if, watch that leg, watch that leg though. I think I could definitely work this out if I wore this with tights or like some leggings for the fall and I do love that it has pockets I know my love for pockets is very very real I actually really love this piece just I need to throw on some underneath because I can't be having all my legs out like that we just we're not gonna work out like that <laughs> so moving on to this next piece I'm obsessed with this dress now I have on a 1x in this dress um, oh, excuse me. I have on a 2X in this dress and I probably could have gone with the 1X, but there was a 1X on the rack, but I love the quilting detailing along this dress. I love the faux uh, leather down the front and the faux leather actually trims along the pocket as well as the bottom hemline of this dress. It hits me a few inches above the knee, which I actually really like. It goes great with booties like I have on here, or you can do some boots, you get throw on some tights, some leggings. Like it's just a great, great dress. It doesn't have quote unquote a shape, but I just really love it. Sometimes you wanna have a dress that's not necessarily all about uh, body for forming to your body. I just love how it fits. It wears really nicely and it just feels so nice on the body. So for this next one, I'm actually here for this. As you can tell, I'm really here for this. I love this top. I thought the pigeons or well, the birds, whatever they are, it's kind of a cute print. Not mentioning my cup of tea, but uh, I thought it was cute. Um, I love the shape of this top. You can see in the back that it's a little bit longer than it is on the front and it does tie around. So it does give your hips and your waist kind of a, a nice little shape. I just love the full on detailing of this top. But my favorite thing is this black pencil skirt. I'm not really sure what the material is with the skirt, but it's just so nice and it fits the body like a glove. Now I have on a 16, I probably could have gone with the 18, but there was no 18 on the rack and I, the 20 was too big. Um, this is a faux pocket, which kind of sucks, but you know what, we could work around it. I just love how it fits. It is form fitting, girl. Um, in this skirt, I ain't going nowhere, but I really love how it fits. It just feels amazing on the body. And I just love how this whole look kind of comes together. As you can see the pleating here on the sleeve, it's just a really nice combination. And the top can be one with something else, so the bottom can be one with something. It's just a great two pieces, <laughs> great separates, which we all need to have in our closet. Now, girl, can we talk? Can we talk? Cause I'm feeling all types of cute in this one. I'm feeling all types of cute in this this one, I'm gonna go ahead and start with this skirt. I'm obsessed with all this skirt. Like, look at it. Look at it move. Like, it's oh, it's amazing. It hits me just slightly below the knee. It's super lightweight. It flows very nicely. I'm surprised at how full the skirt is, and it's actually very, very light. I have on a 2X in this skirt. I could have gone with the 1X, um, but didn't have, didn't have any more on the rack. This has a very nice wide band, which it's a faux suede, so it really, look, it really is very luxurious. It does have pockets. I didn't know that before I put on the skirt, so I was hyped from that it had pockets. <laughs> um, but I really love how this skirt kind of comes together, and it has the light tool along the bottom underneath the skirt there. So it, I mean, this is holidays around the corner, so you could this on with any type of top and you are good to go i paired it with this simple like faux silk top this came in like a pink rose color as well as this ivory color you see this top on for the next uh, couple of bottom pieces but i just wanted to really show off the skirt in this one oh obsessed 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 okay <laughs> moving right along we're gonna go on with this kind of plaid handkerchief bottom skirt i'm giving you all types of farmers only.com realness right now and i'm here for every bit of it but <laughs> but with this skirt i also have on a 2x no i have on a 1x in this skirt and i love how the length is actually kind of fun it's kind of shorter on the side than it is in the front it flows really really well obviously i need to get an iron to this skirt because there's a wrinkle out your mind but it's just a really great casual kind of funky piece it's not for everybody um but you know you can make it work i do think this would be more suited for the taller girl obviously because of the length but if you're shorter listen rock it do what you want to do with it 
again i have on a 1x in this and the 1x fits perfectly and you can tuck anything in it and it does have a side zipper closure here as well no hook and eye just a zipper this skirt, uh, it kind of grew on me. It's it, it's kind of like this heavy knit uh, skirt. Not super duper heavy, but not lightweight either. It does have really, really great stretch. I kind of really love how it flows. Again, as you can see, it has pockets, which you guys know me and pockets on skirts are like my thing. I love the waistband here. I love the stitching in the waistband. It's just overall very made very well. Hits me just about the knee with really nice pleating here. I have on a 2X, could have gone with a 1X, but the because two is a little bit too big but this is all they had on the rack when i went in so but it's a nice skirt just you know not for me <laughs> Now this skirt I'm obsessed with. I really do love this skirt. Now I tried this skirt on at Gwinnie B first, so I had to try it on for you guys here. This is a pencil skirt and it is made of a very nice thick knit. As you can see, this has a huge waistband, <laughs> which I actually really, really like. It's not, doesn't dig into my skin. It's very comfortable easy 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 to wear as you can see it's very high on me because of the length of this skirt i do have on a 1x because the 2x just did not give me the shape that i liked um it does have a slight slit in the back as you can see there you could tuck this in with any black white green it's actually a olive green or like a forest green color really just an amazing an amazing skirt one of my favorite skirts i've tried on this entire try on video here <laughs> but girl girl can we talk can we talk because let me talk about these pants right here let me tell you about these pants because i'm about to get my whole life with these pants right now first and foremost the color the color is amazing i love the length look how long they are y'all know me i am six feet and i always wear heels to get pants that are long enough for me girl come on now i love how this is at my natural waist i love the pleating i love the belt it has pockets it is comfortable girl every bit of this pants is giving me my life right now i had a church moment y'all let's see church come on come on length push through length these, these pants are really amazing i have on a 2x in these pants they go from 1x to 3x these pants are amazing amazing again i have on a size 2x girl so now these pants i'm a little disappointed in because i really wanted these to work i have on a 2x in these pants i definitely needed to go up a size because i feel like these pants should have been a little bit more loose on the body um i really just love the print of these pants the fit for me is just not all the way there it's very tight for me through my thigh and kind of through the the hips there and it actually took me a while to actually button it up because usually that button is struggling um but i just really love the print and i think that with the right size of had i gone up to the 3x I think this could have been a really really cute pant um it's supposed to be short obviously but this is just not it's not doing it for me and i'm not really sure mm, we're gonna hang up we're gonna move on so this i just wanted to show off this really cute double-breasted uh cardigan i saw i was obsessed with the color first and foremost you guys know i love me a good sweater when it gets cold out here and the cold weather is on its way here in jersey i love the knitting along the neckline it is a four button double breasted sweater and there's just two buttons on the inside to keep it actually closed it's super long i just love how the color is it's very cozy it's it basically is a sweater for the cooler weather how that rhymes it has pockets and it hits me right about mid thigh so it's perfect for like leggings and some boots or on a chilly day now underneath that i went with a very casual casual thing here i this knit top very simple i wouldn't wear it over jeans i'm wearing over more of leggings with some boots but i like the little v-neck it has like a three-quarter sleeve very simple this also comes in i think a gray and a black as well as a navy very simple throw it on run your errands or you're gonna chill at home not much to talk about here but it's just an option i really really like how comfortable it is i really love the quality and the feel of it i have on a 1x in this top Ooh, little booby right there <laughs> so the pants here i'm obsessed with all that is melissa mccarthy denim please let me know if you guys want a full-on denim try-on video but this is the same material as the the 
pencil skirt I showed you earlier in the video with the faux pocket in the front. I have on a 18W. I normally wear 18W in her jeans. I wish they were a little bit longer, but you know what? It's cold out. I'll put on some boots. We're all good. It is a pencil um, cut, so it, it's very skinny. It is very body uh, forming but it, you could move in these I don't feel constricted at all the waistband is comfortable so it's a really a, just a good fit her jeans are a bomb if you have not tried them you need to do that like a sap best jeans on the market right now love them and we made it to the last look y'all this is actually not my favorite look I was very surprised I really like the pieces separately but together it's a little bit kind of matching for me not full of really not really here for it but I love the embroidery along the top here the little cutouts and the v-neck I think that's really really cute um I really do love the olive green color of this season I think she has a lot of great pieces that are kind of in that same color family as well it's very very wide <laughs> so it's actually I think this could be a really good option for those of us who are excuse me those of you who are expecting um i like the pleating here in the front it does have pockets so this could be very nice over some leggings if you're kind of into that as well as you can see like i said the pleating here in the front and then it has that same kind of pleating in the back i love that her tops like this are longer in the back than they are in the front so it allows you to wear leggings and so you don't feel like your whole behind is showing again with the jeans i really got these jeans because i liked how it has a little patchwork in between the holes here so if you want to do a distressed look but don't want your legs or your skin to be exposed this is a really a great option and that patchwork matches the bottom of the jeans here again it is meant to be short it's not just because i'm tall so i'm kind of fully and 100 percent here for the for the pieces separately not necessarily together and i have one again at 18w in the bottoms and i have one on a 1x in the top so there you have it, loves. Thank you so much for hanging in there with me for this Melissa McCarthy try on video. I tried on a bunch of stuff and I am pretty much in love with almost everything I tried on. If you would like to purchase anything that I tried on in this video, I will leave links and sizes below as well as on my blog at thickersclosets.com. I'll leave the link to that blog post below as well. Again, thank you for watching. If you would like to see more try on videos, please thumb this video up and leave a comment and if you have not subscribed yet you should definitely hit that button below as well and as always i love you guys and i will see you in my next video bye guys